Okay, hello everybody, and welcome back to Mass Effect 3, if this is indeed a continuation. Uh, Garrus... I mean, Garrus has seen everything there is to see, but bringing... And I want to bring Yavik, because he says interesting things. And they are as bad A, and James does really good melee stuff. Betting we're gonna be in close quarter combat. My sniper rifle is gonna be nearly useless. So maybe, wait, wait, wait. Maybe I shouldn't bring Garrus on this one. Maybe I'll bring Yavik and James. Of course, crowd control. Liara does really good crowd control. Uh, I don't think I brought Liara out yet. So we'll bring Liara and James. Of course, I haven't really brought Edie out yet either, but I think I brought Edie to this last time and I was like, eh! No. I don't know. I just don't th I think most things, Liara doesn't have as interesting conversation options, I think, but. Like, or at least, like, little tidbits. But it would have been cool to bring her to the Solarian home, right, with that whole Shadow Broker thing. Uh, but let's bring, let's bring Yavik and James, I guess. They'll both be pretty good close combat, and I'll be the only weak link that is a sniper. Or at least the only one that's suboptimal. Look at that! 200% recharge speed. I'm a god. What do I have now? The Katana, Centaur, Eviscerator, Claymore, that's the new one. Poo -poo. And the scorpion. I have my mods. Did I? Helps aim through smoke. Okay, good. Got that back. And this is the time perception one. Okie dokie. Wait, no. Uh. Increases weapon stability. I have a bunch now. Reduces weapon kickback. Probably not super important. Increases the damage. Increases accuracy. Hmm. Uh, we'll do stability, I guess. We've got the bullets there and we've got the we do more accuracy that increases the damage capacity is not a big deal let's do yeah James, let's see, uh, so you, so, okay, so you had the scimitar, so I'll probably give you the eviscerator then. Claymore, or oh, give him the claymore. I mean, the fire rate is atrocious, but at least he has the assault rifle to make up for that. Uh, and then we're, we, ah. Let's see if we can't get, a. Uh, Increases damage. Ha <laughs> ha I don't think weapon weight's a big deal for for uh, for squad mates. Damage is obviously not a big deal. We'll get the shotgun shredder. Um. I mean, I guess. Wait, what? Oh yeah. Too bad we don't have something that optimizes the fire rate. I don't think there's much that does that besides increasing it. Well, maybe I won't give him the claymore. I'll give him the eviscerator. It's the best shotgun I have right now. Shotgun shredder mod. And increases the damage. Yeah. Let's do that. And vindicator. So, particle, we could give him the particle rifle. Let's give him, well. It looks like even just the Vindicator. 
Right, so. We need them with a high fire rate with him. So the Avenger has a high fire rate. So does the Vindicator. Particle Rifle does, obviously, but. Vindicator looks kind of like a semi automatic. I mean, I, I can't. I, I've never really played with shotguns much, so. I mean, I did, and then I didn't. So, I don't know. Remember last time being excited for shotguns and then being like they were not as useful. I just used like a rifle the whole time. We'll stick with the Vindicator, but we'll mod it more. Yep, we'll do that one. Increases the stability. Damage and accuracy. Let's do stability. Looking good, boys. Oh, shoot. Um. Arms mass increased power damage. Maybe we should do the shield recharge because he does a lot of melee stuff. Yeah, let's do shield recharge. Um. Increase squad mate health and shields or increase. Yeah, let's do the melee one. Okay. Oh, shoot. I didn't realize. <laughs> I don't know. I just used it all up. Oh, well, that's okay. Yeah, but we can get your pull, buddy. Buddy, old pal. Uh, what's the next one on pull? Sure. We'll keep him pretty even. Pretty even across the board. Not really specializing in anything. Shepard, you look so good. Uh, looks good. Looking good to me. Looking good to me. Ended up not having to go to work too long tonight, and I was like so excited. So I'm playing some extra video games, and I'll even be able to upload some Witcher tonight. It'll be really late, and nobody will see it, but I'm gonna do it. Well, take that tonight when I'm recording. It won't be when this goes up. But. Shepard, server strike squads have infiltrated one of the major cities on Benning. Initial reports indicated they were recruiting civilians, but further investigations suggest that the people are being taken against their will. For what purpose? Unknown. We sent a recon team to investigate, and the Cerberus squads reacted by targeting civilians in public facilities. Officially, Cerberus is denying responsibility and condemning the action. They're either lying, or we're dealing with a rogue faction. And innocents are caught in their crosshairs. Exactly. Secure the area so we can establish a rescue lifeline to the rest of the city. Approaching the drop point, Commander. Copy that, Lieutenant. The people down there are counting on you, Commander. Hack it out. The people everywhere are counting on me, Hackett. You're no help. Could you imagine living in a city like this, though? It's all like sardines in a can. Pretty cool, though. On my way. Keep me updated. Let's go, please. Oh, crap. Holy crap, are they really... Hold up. Can't save. I need to keep an eye out for... Where are you at? Oh crap, you died. Where are they though? Stay away. Where are they? Okay, this next okay, next time I'm gonna I'm gonna need to explore this place better, but I need to I need to save the civilians. Where there we are. Oh wait.
get him at all? No. Where's the other one? Save civilians, that's my priority. Woo! Explosions. Any more? Yep. Oh crap. Uh we'll get him. Crap. Oh my gosh, little drone, I'm gonna be so angry at you. You don't do anything. Why is he not dead yet? Wow, that was epic. I mean, I just, I keep thinking I should save that, but. Upper streets are clear. Hold on, Commander. What is it, Lieutenant? I'm tracking civilians fleeing the city with Cerberus troops right behind. Where are they? Updating your nav point. You can intercept them there. Ah! They won't know what he did. Wait, where are they? Where are they? Over there? Okay. It's only target. I can. Where's the centurion? Did he die? Oh no, there he is. Dang it! Oh, I think I got him. Nice. Okay. Nice! That was efficient. Okay, I gotta find the evidence. Thoroughly scanning. I mean, what the Cerberus think they're gonna achieve by this? Like, I know they're just trying to get people for their experiments, probably, but still, it's like... They're just hindering. They're, all, they're only hindering humanity's I mean, they're, they're hurting humans, like... This just makes things worse for everybody, for all of us. Is it a bathroom? It is a bathroom. They have us surrounded. Private security from the depot tried to help, but they got slaughtered. Someone has to know. Someone has... Svetlana Alexandrov. Is this where I started? Yes. Okay, so I've thoroughly explored this quadrant, I think. Okay. Yeah. What? I know there's some people over here. Hey! Yemens! Yeah, Look! Reinforcements are here! Right Try here? To stay calm. What should we do? Just Hide. stay down. Hide. Commander, more. Service troops are heading your way. If you hold the line there, it'll give us civilians time to escape. You heard him. We hold here. There's so many. Okay. Drone, go do something useful. As long as there's like none that approach from here, we'll be good. Drone, you're useless. Uh. Oh, dang it, forgot. Universal cooldown. My shields are, whoa, crap. James, there's like dudes right there. James, oh. Oh, 
come on. There we go. No? Oh, crap. I did try to take that because I uh, didn't want them to get hit. I don't know if that actually makes a difference, but oh hey, well there's still dudes. Are there any on the upper floors, or are they all below? You're not gonna die being so dramatic. Are they in there? Or are they like somehow firing? Ah, there you are. Dang it, I keep. Centurion. myself because I'm so dang good at this game. <laughs> oh crap. Who did that? Well, you're gonna die. Don't worry about you guys are fine. You're fine. Is he coming around? I saw James shooting off in this direction. I missed his head. Let's go. Uh, well, you know. Wow. Defend the civilians. Okay. Well, why are you walking forward then? Centurion, I see you. Changed my daily walk. There we go. Can't see anything. There you are. I can only see through my sniper rifle. Oh, come on. That was a headshot. Run right, they just ran right past one. Great. Oh my gosh, no. I'm way too close. anything. Can we get rid of the turret? Yeah, freaking what the heck am I doing right here in the middle of everything? I am a sniper. <laughs> he just headshotted him through the smoke. There's people sneaking up behind us. Is, are you 
are you like duking it out with that guy? I hope you can handle it. Hit, hit. I can't, why can't I peek around corners? Oh no, you don't. Stand up. So many of them. <clears throat> if only that thing worked like it was supposed to. Is he like right in front of you? Where is he at? Did you kill him? Where are you at? I saw it. Saw something. There you are. Somewhere over there. There you are. Combat engineer. No, you. Oh, crap. You put down a turret. Eh? Turret. Oh, okay. Turret. Okay. You're not gonna die. You're invincible, apparently. Firepower. Um. No. Yeah, I guess so. Why not? Got you. Stand up. Dead. Should be dead. I won't under. You're clear. Go. Okay. We're gonna make it. No hostiles detected in the immediate area, Commander. Reinforcements are moving in to secure the evac route. Good, Good. work, everyone. I'll pick you up at the LZ, Commander. All right. Let me look around. Good, so this does give me a chance to look around. We were in here, so we've already been in here. The area is not that big, apparently. I'm gonna look it up while I'm walking around. Well, maybe if I can multitask that well. Probably gonna pass right by it. Burning evidence. Yeah. Uh, this is actually a really cool area to look around too. Like just to look at. Can I get down there? Interesting. I mean, it's kind of, it's really grungy and kind of like, ee looking, but, like, I wouldn't want to actually live here, but it's pretty cool. Like, it looks very much like you'd think of sort of a futuristic city would look. The bedding evidence is supposedly hidden in a pretty intense corner. And we should, we should honestly be encountering Reaper for, well, I guess they, they did say specifically that they took out the major stuff. Um, oh, what was that? Oh. Uh, but the Reapers aren't in here, like, big time because they figure they can come back. <laughs> they are the, located in the courtyard opposite the building number 27. Nine hundred and seventy-five. 
Oh, they're on the ground. Apparently easily missed. Oh, where's 27? I'm seeing much bigger numbers than 27. I might, oh, there's 22. Uh, 27. I was in 27, okay. Next to the closest square column to building number 22. Ah! Are you serious? <coughs> you would never think to look there. Oh, uh, excuse the coughing fit. I apologize. Oh, there's some ammo. Never really without it, but... There we go. I was like, I can't remember where I am. Well, cool. I'm glad we got that because it always weirded me out to just have it, like, picked up. And then be like... I mean same time like I wish you could see more like <coughs> just his dog tags don't prove anything you know an actual body would be what you would want but I mean maybe he was basically incinerated apparently it was really brutal the way he was taken out so is this uh, help civilian help or help for civilians hey what's up I see you just floating there. You just landed there. <coughs> Which reminds me from the, of the orbs from Inquisition for some reason. Alright, we came. Got what we came for. I do remember checking this out. I mean, the streets are like abandoned. Every now and then you see something flying by. You would think you'd see more people, but there's the major city. Cool. I mean, this is really well designed, I think. Kind of how a rural, futuristic area would totally look. I mean, it definitely has fifth element vibes, right? But still, very cool. I think that's actually a police uh, escort. I think that's the only civilian group you can rescue. Which doesn't seem like a lot of people, but you know, whatever. We're like, yeah, we killed off a few Cerberus. It's good. It's great. We just helped take the city. Uh, no. Not how it works. The Reapers aren't here, though, which is nice. We're just fighting augmented humans. Which reminds me, I need to play Deus Ex sometime. Need to finish it, anyway. We're getting reports of continuing strikes against other cities on Benning. Cerberus still denying responsibility? Yes, and for once we're inclined to believe them gunning down innocent humans isn't their usual M.O. Either way, the civilians down there have a chance now. We're solidifying the foothold and getting people out, then we'll move to liberating the rest of the planet. I hope we can say the same for Earth. One day, Commander. For now, we've got our work cut out for us. Carry on. That was fast. <clears throat> One day, for sure, we're gonna go down, 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 down. Ball hints. We've got Benning. Arcturus First Division is a volunteer army of civilians, paramilitary forces, and reserve soldiers who have banded together to stop Reaper occupation of the planet Benning. To avoid detection by river forces, its members operate in cells, never staying in one place long. A handful of Alliance officers are coordinating the First Division, sharing intel and sending supplies to the resistance soldiers. A few Alliance squadrons have been spared to support Benning's makeshift army with trained soldiers. Perfect. Look at us. Look at us. So got a long way to go, but we're getting there. 
Uh, I guess there's really nobody to talk to about it. So, Reapers don't have colonies. You can't bomb them, or you're bombing what's left of your own planet. Yep. They make their own soldiers out of our civilians. They don't have supply lines. How do you beat something like that? I'll let you know if I think of something. Let me know, too. <laughs> Commander, Chief Engineer Alice oh. would like to speak with you down in engineering. All right. Look at that galaxy map. Do you know how many strategy games <laughs> are built from that internet? <laughs> you play strategy games? A few. Most are too flashy, though. I prefer chess. I have a set made from rose quartz and hematite packs. Dude, I have one from I rose quartz and... something solid in my hands. Regular quartz. Well, now that I know your weakness, we might have to try a game. <laughs> It'd be more fun than playing Edie. Edie doesn't sweat. <laughs> you sweat playing chess? Depends on how much fun we're having. <laughs> Shepard, we're working on something like I show you. Can we meet in your quarters and you have a moment? Dang, we're already at that point? Jeez. Well, let's go talk to uh, Adams. Is he still in engineering? Is he? Did he boop down to engineering just so I could talk to him? I can't remember exactly what he wants. Someday I'd like to know exactly what triggers a lot of these things, like the acquisition of certain quests and stuff, or certain missions. Like, is it just time, or how many missions you've done, or what, what certain... I mean, some of them are obviously certain Johnny, missions. Have you ever seen recordings of Liara's mother, Matriarch Benezia? Yes. What about her? I remember Samara, the Asari. <laughs> Where are you going with this, Kenneth? Have you noticed that older Asari women seem to be a bit more ample? Do you think they just keep growing? <laughs> Kenneth! I think I'll spend my sunset days in an Asari retirement. Yeah, good luck. If I don't kill you first. Uh, good luck with that. Adams! Commander, remember the problem I mentioned? Yes! About a core overload possibly venting into the engineering compartment? Daniels, Donnelly, Edie, and I have been brainstorming and comparing notes. You see, the venting occurs when IES is <laughs> back cycle. At the same moment, the main core is at peak draw, such as from sustained kinetic. What Kenneth means to say is that we're pretty sure we can make the system safer. We just need a GX-12 thermal pipe. Unfortunately, we're cut off from Alliance supply chain. Why? Could we're you the keep an eye out for tip one of the, the spear. next on the Citadel, Commander? I've got the specs right here. Sure, sure. Are these modifications really necessary? It's a safety issue, not exactly critical. Under extreme conditions like heavy bombardment to the kinetic barriers while traveling at peak flight speeds, plasma can vent into this compartment. It would vaporize anyone standing in this room. That sounds more serious than just a safety issue. Well, under those conditions, odds are you're about to lose the entire ship anyway. Well, there you go. But we want every advantage we can get, right? Heck yeah. I'll look for one the next time we go to the Citadel. Thanks, Commander. Or you could just, you could buy one. I give you permission to buy one. Go, Adams. Go. Go buy one. Have some, have some pocket change. Ten million credits. And off you go. Let's see where everybody's at. If they've moved around. Diana, Javik. Garrus is back in the battery. Chuck was still in the crew quarters. Alright, everyone's where they're supposed to be. Um, but I guess I'll call this one here. It's been going a little bit long, but that's alright. I wanted to wanted to play some Mass Effect 3. It's been a while. I always enjoy this game. Except for the sad parts. And those I still enjoy because I'm a masochist. <laughs> um, but anyway, I hope you guys are enjoying. You seem to be. This one seems to be a pretty popular one so far. So I'm, I'm glad. I'm glad you guys are enjoying it even though I've already played before. It makes me makes me happy. And sorry again for being sick. I'll do my best to get better. <laughs> um, but anyway, thanks again, guys. I appreciate your support. I'll see you in the next one.